What's up, YouTube? Let me turn this off because I don't have echo. <laughs> this is your boy Wolfrock coming to you guys with another reaction video. Um, I'm doing some more of my favorite singer. Now, I've told you guys this before that I really love Laura Fabian. She is one that I followed from years and years. So to all you uh, French people uh, that are out there, you guys will really, really enjoy this because this is one of her French songs that I really enjoy. I really love it. Um, I've never seen the official video, so this would be very fun to watch. Um, uh, and all, like I always say, is bonjour pour tout le monde aussi. Uh, si vous parlez français, c'est bien. Si vous parlez pas français, c'est dommage. So je vais parler en anglais. So ça, ça marche comme ça. Anyway, we're going to speak English, not French. <laughs> I'm just telling those other people that are French that uh, for those that are French, I'm not going to do it in, in French. I'm doing it in English. So everybody can understand. The song itself is in French. So get your uh, closed caption on. You'll be able to. Uh, the lyrics are very, very, very cool. Um, for for lack of translation, so you guys know what it is. The song is called uh, "My Life in Yours." Um, so in case you wanted to know what the song is, it, it, the title of the song is, so that you guys know. You can see it. It's not in French. It's not in English. It's in French. Um, so anyway, it is what it is. Uh, just by the way, before we get started on the uh, video, I uh, just wanted to let, let you guys know that uh, the viewing for my next door neighbor went really, really well. There was a lot of people, so many people that went. Um, and also the funeral that uh, today was the funeral. And that went really well as well. So much, um, so much love. And, and, you know, I, I wish more neighborhoods in our world would be like this neighborhood that I'm living in right now. Uh, so many people came together to support this family. Um, I just left her house just a little bit ago. Well, we spent pretty much all day with them. Um, there's so many people over there, over there right now. We're just having a good time. We're, we're celebrating his life. And uh, so we have a fire pit in the back and that uh, we got started. We're just it's a big feast and meal and stuff like that. You guys know when we have funerals, that typically that's what happens. But they're going to be there for a while. So I told him, says, uh, since you got enough support, I'm going to let you uh, let, let her do her thing. But there's probably, probably 80, 90 people over there right now. Uh, it's not a real big house, but still, it's just so much support. I'm really, really happy to see that. So anyway, for that further ado, let's get into this song here because... I really, really love this one. And by the way, Mike, I hope you enjoy it. I know it's in French, but, you know, hey, whatever. <laughs> you don't need to know the lyrics. It's like Dimash and... Uh, uh, what's that other guy's name? Victor Wu? Yu? Also another one that has lyrics that I can't understand anyway. You know. And my fin is... Eh, eh, I'm still working on it. <laughs> okay. Let's do do this. All right. Three, two, one, go. Oh, there she is. Ferme la porte et pose ton manteau juste là. Assieds-toi près de moi. God, this song is so beautiful. Ce que j'ai à te dire, je ne le dirai qu'une seule fois, je ne le dirai qu'à toi. Si j'avais su les torrents des vallées sur ma terre, si j'avais vu les brûlures, such a beautiful lady too. Not just si outward, but inwardly, beautiful lady. Impossible à les retours. Là. God, her vocals. J'aurais mis ma vie dans la tienne. Comme on mélange sans des veines. Je serais resté près de toi. Crois-moi, des éléments qui se déchaînent. Tu m'aurais protégé de moi. Mon âme, ma reine. Tant de temps que je t'aime. My life in yours. Si 
J'avais cru qu'il fallait ne pas y croire Dommage Les oasis du désert ne sont jamais que des mirages Si j'avais su tout ça Les grandes promesses qui tournent court On oui. a song you know laura always has a uh emotional songs and she's done so many of them but this one here is just another one of those examples of her vocal ranges of just sweet just beautiful crystal clear i've heard this song before so it's not like a, a fair reaction but i wanted to share this video because i have not seen the official video of this song I have a lot of her CDs and a lot of her music that I actually, uh, I'm a really big fan of, her, of Laura's as well. I don't do a lot of reaction videos because typically a lot of her reaction videos tend to get blocked or get uh, uh, a copyright strikes on, on your channel. But this one I know doesn't. It's just, it, it is what it is. But I really, really love her vocals. I really love this song. It's a very pretty song. If you don't know the song, here, let me, let me pull it up real quick so that way... Um, give you guys a little bit of a kind of a history. Um, uh, da, da, da. All right, so the song itself is it's really it's it's a pretty song. Don't get me wrong. So again, it's it's one of those songs that you either love or hate. It's you. <laughs> there's no like in between. But I really wanted to see the official ver. Uh, ver this is like two thousand. 14, 15, if I remember right, somewhere around there when this one was released ish. Um, so let me see if I can pull it up as soon as it comes up. Please wait. You got to love the internet. I think it's because we have so many people next door. Everybody's on Wi Fi. <laughs> well, it is what it is. It's okay. Ah. Uh... If it ever pulls up. Well, it looks like it doesn't pull up. So we're going to have to do it another time. It looks like. Oh, here we go. Okay. So. All right. So let me give you the lyrics. All right. So it goes like this. Uh, it starts out by saying, close the door, put your coat or right there and sit next to me. If you remember, she was on the couch and she hands, she puts her hand down on the couch. That's telling, uh, everybody to, to kind of sit down right there or telling him to sit down. And then, uh, it continues by saying, uh, what, what I have to say, it's kind of interesting. The French translation to the English in the computer is a little bit different when I was listening to the words. Uh, some of the, the, actual wording is a little bit off 
not by a lot, but just certain words are used instead of the French uh, uh, dialect is a little bit different. Anyway, continue on. What I have to say, I will only say it once. I will, I will only say it to you. If I had known uh, the tor uh, torrents uh, hurling down on, on my earth, if I had uh, seen the burns rip through my skin, if I had known all the impossible back and forth of love, I would have put my life in yours. Uh, like the mixture of veins blood, I would have stained near you, believe me. The elements that are unleashed, you would have protected me from myself, my soul, sister, my queen. So much time that I have loved you. Give me your hand, I beg you, do not remove it. You, what binds us is beyond organic, uh, mineral, karma, karmic, uh, indefinable. What binds me to you goes beyond. If I had believed that it was not necessary to believe, oh well, the desert oasis are never. The, and some of... I'm looking at some of the words, and I remember the song. And I'm like, that's not exactly what it says, but it's close. Uh, you know, it's kind of one of those songs where you just kind of go, well, or you got to take it for when you do the translation. Uh, miracles, if I had known all, the big promises that turn short in love, I would have put my life in yours. Like the mixture of veins blood, I would have stayed near you. And it goes on, believe me, uh, and then it repeats itself on the same verse with my soul sister, my queen, next time, maybe in a thousand years, I already know. And then it, it concludes by saying this last verse, which I think really sums up the song. In another world, you will put your life in mind. We will go where our hearts lead us. We will stay here with me. From your hopes, your joys, your sorrow, I will protect you from yourself. You will Put your life in mine, and we will go where our hearts lead us. We will stay here with me. Believe me, from your hopes and your joys and your sorrow, I will protect you from yourself. My soul, sister, my queen, so much time that I love you. So much time that I love you. Interesting. Um, that really sums up the song for me. Uh, and I think that that's something that a lot of uh, artists uh, really don't take into effect, uh, consideration when they do a lot of these songs and lyrics. They don't really think the overall um, theme of their song and what they're trying to present. Like, I'll give you an example. Dimash does it such a beautifully with his lyrics. Uh, Tomas, for example, from Nightwish, does a really amazing job. Uh, Metallica does an amazing job also with some of their lace, uh, the lyrics. ACDC, if you haven't heard of them, also another one of those bands that you just look at and you're like, wow, their lyrics are pretty powerful if you go actually read into it. And I, I can keep going. There's so many artists. Angelina Jordan is a great example. Uh, uh, there's so many artists out there that are so passionate about their lyrics and then they put the songs to the lyrics. Where a lot of artists that I've seen do the opposite. They come up with a... a a, a musical piece, and then they put lyrics to that, where a lot of these wonderful artists do the opposite. They come up with the lyrics, and then they put their music behind it. Two different uh, types of music background, and the the emotion that's between the two, definitely so much different. That's why I love these artists that do it this way. The reason I know this about her is because I actually uh, spent a little time on uh, with uh, seeing an article and a newsreel that they well, I wasn't it wasn't a newsreel it was more like a, a documentary where she talked about it it was a French episode where she actually says that when she writes she doesn't write from music she writes from like experiences first and then she puts that experience and then she writes the music for it a great example like i was telling you about like tomas he has an experience he has it in words then he puts it in music it's just an interesting concept i don't know why i brought that up but it's just something that i really find fascinating with music um i don't know it's just my two cents you know how i am with my two cents anyway this is your boy uh wolf rock coming to you guys with another reaction video mike i hope you enjoyed it as much as i have and I will catch you guys on the next video. And as always, stay classic. And thank you for watching and subscribing to this wonderful little guy called Wolf Rock. Not a big deal in this little world. I'm just a little small fish in a little pond that really enjoys music. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this particular song as much as I have. We'll catch you guys next time. And as always, stay classic. Thank you so much.